Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve the video schedule internal error you might be getting on your Windows computer. So this should be hopefully a pretty quick tutorial and we're going to jump right into it. So we're going to go through a couple of potential workarounds for this. And we're going to start by opening up the star menu. And you want to type in device manager. Best man should say device manager directly above control panel. You want to left click on that one time. And now that we're in device manager, you want to expand the display adapters view by left clicking the little arrow next to it. And now whatever display adapter is listed here, you want to right click on it. And then left click on properties. Now you want to go up to the driver tab. And the first thing I'd recommend doing is trying to update driver. So select that option. And then you want to search automatically for updated driver software. And if it says the best driver is already installed, search for updates on Windows Update as well. So I'd recommend conducting a Windows Update search for it as well. If you had an option to roll back the driver, if it wasn't already the only version that was installed, I'd recommend rolling it back as well. And in between both of those, I'd recommend restarting your computer. If you're still experiencing the issue, I would take note of whatever display adapter is listed here. Because I'm in a virtual environment, it has a VMware display adapter. Most of you guys should have an AMD or NVIDIA display adapter. You want to go online. So using any web browser doesn't really matter. I would recommend navigating over to Google. And this is pretty much the same whether you're using NVIDIA or AMD. I've done tutorials like this in the past. And all you pretty much want to do is just type in NVIDIA display adapter download. And you want to hit enter and you'd want to go on NVIDIA's website here and just select download drivers. You could also select automatically download from the Google search results where you could go onto their own page here and just by looking at it you can see option 2 says automatically find drivers for my NVIDIA products. You would just left click on graphic drivers right there and then it would begin running a scan if you needed to install Java you would do that and the same would go for AMD drivers as well and then you just go underneath download drivers and then there should be an option to auto detect the driver software as well. So you just would select automatically detect and install your driver and download now. And it's pretty much the same if you have any other display adapters as well. I'd recommend trying that out and it should be pretty straightforward. So I do hope this brief tutorial was able to help you guys out. And as always, thank you for watching and I look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.